<laughs> Mr. Kramer. Shh, this is the best part. My name is Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. I'm investigating the case of the origami killer. I'd like to ask you a few questions. <laughs> I'd like to know exactly what happened to little Joseph Brown. Beat it! You hear me? Get the hell out of here! What do you want? A witness saw little Joseph Brown get in the back of your limousine. That was the last time anybody ever saw it. Now I know you've been arrested and interrogated until your father made a little phone call and the file was closed. I'd like to hear your version of the facts. The kid was lost. I just offered to drive him home. The police arrived, I explained the misunderstanding, and I was released. End of story. Nothing to get excited about, right? You don't think I'm gonna fall for that shit, do you, Kramer? I know it's not the first time you tried to lure a kid into your car. I also know you are more than a suspect for the police. Now, if I were you, I think of something more credible. Otherwise, I'm going to make sure you have some serious problems. Very well. I'm the origami killer. I get my victims into my car. I drown them in rainwater. Then I dump them on a wasteland with an origami figure in one hand and an orchid on their chest. I do that because I'm bored, Mr. Shelby. And it's a creative and entertaining way of having fun. Is that good enough for you? Or do you want more? This interview is over. Get rid of this clown! It's a dangerous game you're playing, Kramer. Do you know who my father is? He only has to lift one finger and you won't wake up tomorrow morning. You're the one that should be afraid, Mr. Shelby. Not me.
It might be a trap. I had better be careful. What the hell am I supposed to do here? This is the old Pico power station. I thought it was abandoned. Now where am I supposed to go? There must be a clue or something. The origami figure was in the form of a butterfly. So, am I looking for a butterfly? Electrical condensers. Going by the sound of them, they're still active. I should never have got into this pipe. It's suicide. Where's this pipe go? I've got a bad feeling. Whoa! Glass. Broken glass. Sharp as a razor. Impossible to go back. I'm gonna have to crawl through it, slowly, so I don't tear up my arms. The match flame. It indicates where the fresh air comes from. All I have to do is follow the wind. Rats. Charming. If they got in, then maybe I can get out. 